This week, we welcome Elgin Academy for their ultimate player experience of Newcastle and Manchester. It's an action-packed trip, but first, let's hear the teams line up. experience was phenomenal, uh, the kids really enjoyed it, uh, a lot of the kids had just been used to going to Borough Briggs which is maybe a two or three thousand capacity and to be in a stadium that's got 55,000 was phenomenal, uh, they got an experience of the changing rooms which were excellent and it just gave them an insight into the professional life. Just play good football you know, pass it back, pass on the style, take a tackle. Stand pitch, bang bang, to the net. I've really been impressed with uh, the pupils' response to the coach. Uh, they've been listening really well and they've been working really hard. And you can see that the kids have got a really good ethos and a good, a, a hard working approach. After having a good training session with Stag today, we're feeling pretty confident. Another action-packed day ahead for the Elmgren Academy boys. They're going to be taking a stadium tour here at St James's Park, Laser Quest competition, coaching with elite level coaches and finally challenge matches versus local opposition. took my gun quite confident and uh, I dominated most of it. Dan's actually, you can see, he's working with him particularly well. The boys are getting warmed up um, and we're looking forward to the game ahead. Yes, a very good morning to you and welcome to Trans World Soccer Sports News. You join me in day three of the Elgin Academy Ultimate Player Experience. And I'm standing in a very balmy and warm townside. The boys are in the middle of a World Cup five-a-side football tournament. And later on today, we're off to the game at St James's Park versus West Brock. forward to the atmosphere, doesn't yeah. We're 
really happy and the kids are, are spoiled, they really are because they've had such a good time and uh, everything's been brilliant so far.